so I have spent the last three weeks reading, thinking, and then categorizing. And I'm talking about the mental health conversation that we are about to start having. So reading is because um, this, this has become my reading. Ignore the Harvard catalog. I'm thinking of going back to school very soon again. So I've been reading the different emails I was sent. So I've been reading and then understanding and then categorizing. I have read every email. I have read every story. And I think that's why it took me a moment to figure out how do we do this. It's one thing for me to say, I want to talk about mental illness. It's another when you respond in such a way that I am not left. Oh, by the way, I print on both sides of everything. So if you realize this has been recycled, it's because I do recycle heavily. It's one thing for me to say, let's have the conversation. It's another for me to get over 95 emails that now I have to read each of them and then begin to understand where we're going. So, so far, let me tell you what I've learned and then what we're gonna do. I understand so far that mental illnesses can, is categorized into depression, anxiety, bipolar, and I found out from your emails, there's bipolar too. So it's not just all bipolar postpartum depression. I have also understood that unpacking each of those is important to do it separately so that we all don't go around thinking that all mental illness is created equal, okay? So for me, what was important was to categorize. So if, if you actually see the folders I have all these emails in, you know, I've decided we'll have a conversation on depression we'll have a conversation with, on depression and suicide. There's an amazing lady who wrote to me and says she's actually attempted suicide four times. The first time when she was 10. I think the first thing I will ask her when I finally get her, you know, across the table from me is, how does a 10 year old know how to die? You know, so you, there's a lot for me to take in. Um, so there is that, there is understanding that there's a need to talk about anxiety on its own and also from your emails i realize it's misdiagnosed as asthma there's a need to understand bipolar and bipolar 2 and there's a need to understand postpartum depression i'm sure there's a lot more but that's where i am at the moment um once again i will start from what do we need to know? So this is how I will approach the conversation. Three parts, because I'm not trying to fix the problem. I'm trying to start the conversation so that in the same way, when a friend comes to you and says, I'm feeling this, 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 you know they have a cold or um, this are my symptoms. You're like, oh, this is what the problem is because we seem to be able to recognize every other illness, but this one. So number one, recognizing it, understanding what it means for you and then where you go for help. So part of the conversation as well will mean that when I'm done understanding where the individuals who are saying, I'm happy to come onto your platform and talk about my journey, we then also talk about what's the diagnosis? What's the treatment? What do I need to know? Where can I go? Who can I call? Okay, but I need you to understand for me, I'd like to spark the conversation. I'm hoping media as a whole will run with it so that we're not in this place where we don't understand what's going on and then we gasp and also you must remember in the last couple of weeks you know waking up to hear about you know the founder behind um kate spade had killed herself at 55 and of course anthony from um cnn um committing suicide at 61. my mind boggles because i'm like so how do you get there how do you get there to that place where you say, let's end it? And why? Uh, the, the, I have so many questions. So I needed to give you an update on what it is um, I'm doing. So chances are the next time you see me, I'll have kicked off the conversation with um, two people, three people, who'll be the first people to sit you know, around a table with me and just explain this thing that nobody talks about okay so subscribe you need to otherwise you won't know when we're ready to go and tell your friends as well all right thank you